Well then, buddy. So, week four coin deadlift. Top set, 192. Felt good. Um, I'd say it moved pretty quick considering that it's close to, uh, well, it's the max that I set for the routine. I set it quite conservatively at 190. I don't know, I've pulled one to uh, I've pulled 200 before, but at the start of this, I didn't feel like I'd be good for it, so I just went for 190. Anyway, I did it for two, felt good. The 170 with bands was horrendous. Um, <coughs> two sets of 160 with bands, very slow, very horrible. So I took them off. And the last three sets for speed was, oh, it was, it was lovely. The bar just felt so fucking light, it was unreal. Uh, I did some stiff leg deadlifts. I only did two sets. I'm still not 100% with the uh, man flow. So like I've been saying to a few people in the comments, I've, seems like everybody's ill at the minute. Uh, just play by ear, you know. Get in there. If you might, if you might have a routine that says you've got to do X amount of sets, X amount of reps, blah blah blah. It's good if you can stick to that. But if you're doing it and you start feeling a bit fucking queasy and not good, and you just feel poorly, there's no point in like ruining yourself. Just, just call it that. You know, do what you can and just move on. Like, I ain't done no pendulum rows, I ain't done no pull downs. I do some glute ham raises and some just some rope curls, and that's about it really. Uh, Except um, I got the main stuff done, that's what counts. Anyway, there you go. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, friends, subscribe if you haven't already. I'll see you in the next video. Oh yeah. And that's the problem when you have the heater on in here. It gets really hot really quick. That's why I end up with my tits out.